up, peeps? Uh, we are just on our way to um, crowd therapy and then um, our Scottsdale team meeting, our weekly team meeting from our Revisto Real Estate Group. This morning just got done uh, shooting, shit, what we shoot, three or four um, uh, videos plus a leveling up and you got uh, my boy Bobby over here to the left driving while I'm grinding out some Facebook ads, get some shit done and uh, getting ready for an epic fucking day. See you guys soon. Hey, my name is Angelo Alvarez, uh, Scottsdale Cryotherapy. So we're tricking the brain into hypothermia to go into survival mode. He's not really experiencing hypothermia, but uh, the brain thinks he is. So he goes into this survival mode with the uh, vessels constrict. All the blood goes to the core to protect his vital organs while he's in there chilling. Once he comes out and brain senses it's safe again, those vessels dilate almost four times as great. So all that blood that was oxygenating and enriching in the core, protecting his organs, just flush through the body and back into the extremities. And now the endorphins kick in and all that, and it actually will calm him throughout the whole day, but also give him steady any flow of energy. Shit I go through just to do webinars and to speak, man. <laughs> Why do you do that? The crowd therapy? Yeah. Yeah, dude, so um, it's because I'm committed, man. Committed to doing what I do. So a couple years ago, <coughs> when I got into um, more of the training, the consulting, the public speaking, webinars, um, you know, just, just sort of trashing my vocal cords, dude. So I got to the point, literally for like almost two years of my life, I lived with massive pain in my right eardrum, all the way down my carotid up into my upper chest and, and was seeing ENTs after ENTs, always specialists and um, nobody could find a cure. And then I found cryotherapy. It's the only thing that I've been able to do that uh, actually goes out there and re repairs and, and, and helps my vocal cords recover. So I do all that shit because I'm committed to going out there and doing the podcast, committed to doing my webinars, committed to growing what I'm doing and, and the movement, dude. So when you're committed, you do what it takes no matter what, even if it's freezing your body every single week. <laughs> uh, um, but you go to the extreme to do what you gotta do um, to create what you wanna create. So it's all about the commitment. Now what? Now it's uh, green smoothie time. Look at how cold he is. <laughs> all right, camera, go away. How's it taste, Bobby? It tastes like shit, so I took it like a shot. Tastes like absolute hell, dude, but that's when you know it's doing your body right, dude. If it tastes like shit, it's good for you. God played like this really funky trick on us, right, where anything that tastes good is bad for us. If it tastes bad, it's good for you. So I always tell Bobby, I'm like, dude, I know you like to smoke a little green, but you got to drink a little green as well <laughs> <laughs> to do the body right. <laughs> All right, peeps, now we're on our way to our weekly team meeting for my real estate company and then back to the studio to do more, uh, more webinars. Um, back at the office at six that morning. Then that day we had client. <laughs> Camera moved. <laughs> client associate. We'll do this later, guys.